hello everyone so today I will explain you about uh, class diagram so how to create class diagram into the ergo UML tool so this is just one example so let's say there is one class for the animal okay so for the animal there is a particular ID we have given that for the dog ID 1 cat ID 2 kind of that way and the name of animal like cat dog whatever name is there and there are a few functions let's say set name and get is so we can modify the particular name of that uh, uh, animal and also get is for the getting what is the edge of that particular animal and it is inherited so inherit uh, so here inheritance is there so cat is inherited from the uh, animal so its animals attribute will come under the cat because cat is also an uh, animal so if you see here uh, so uh, this attribute will come under the cat also and additional there are a few other attribute for the cat so which is tail length which is integer and its function is there uh, so this is called uh, generalization uh, and uh, there is one another thing is also association so let's say cat eats mouse so here association is also there so so we'll see that how to create this type of uh, class diagrams so uh, let's start so so for creating new class diagram if you see on the top like there are different diagrams are available so here uh, use case diagram class diagram sequence etc there are different diagrams are there so if you want to create new class diagram you have to just click on here class diagram so once you click here then all the class diagram related uh, uh, attributes will come here so for that we have to pick this one new class so our class is animal so I click here and then I click like this way so I can make it bigger and I will click here uh, and animal so this is animal class is created now for adding attribute there is one uh, here uh, plus sign is there so if you click here it will give you attribute so you can add ID again if you click here uh, a new attribute will become which I can add as a name as string okay so we have to give data type and here all the methods will be there so uh, if you click here again plus sign will be there so you can click here and write like uh, set name and uh, uh, other method you want to add uh, like get age so kind of that way you can uh, add uh, this uh, create this class so for that class you can see its properties difference are available you can change like public protected private member even for the member also if I click on the member uh, so here you can see the visibility and you can add details also you can do documentation also here and there are different uh, parameters are there so you can use that uh, also if required uh, for the each now uh, like I want to do uh, uh, inheritance so I will click here if you see here icon I can click here so it will give the inheritance or the here also options are there generalization for the generalization so here you can add now uh, your cat cat and uh, you can write tail length and uh, again get tail length okay you can write that way and uh, you can if you click here you will see that uh, associations uh, here so if you click here uh, also this is available here also you can directly click and create and here uh, if you click here uh, then you can write its so cat its mouse and uh, its property you can add like weight or get weight whatever so this way you can create a class diagram and for the class diagram you can see the details also here for the particular class diagram like animal cat mouse so all the points you can see here and you can set the property as well so uh, here in the property you can modify that and uh, detail documentation so kind of that way you can easily create a class diagram so here there are for the aggregation 
there are different uh, functionalities are available so you can use that and create a class diagram very easily okay so thank you for watching this video and please uh, subscribe to devputer software for the more informative and technical video thank you thank you very much